Hello and welcome to the video tutorials by Be Smart Education. In this series, we will guide you through various aspects of English grammar to help you improve your language skills. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more educational videos and tutorials. Click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Let's get started. The requirements for level B2. At the B2 level, you will learn advanced quantifiers like several, plenty, and a great deal of, and indefinite pronouns such as someone, anything, and nobody. You will master the future perfect, I will have finished by tomorrow, and future perfect continuous, I will have been working here for five years, tenses. You will also use the passive voice in various tenses. The project was completed by the team, and modal verbs for deduction, must, might, can't, to express certainty or possibility. Understanding complex adjective order, a beautiful old Italian villa, and gradable and non-gradable adjectives, very happy, absolutely fantastic, will enhance your descriptions. You will use adverbs of manner, quickly, degree, extremely, duration, briefly, and frequency, often. Master advanced prepositional phrases in addition to, and conjunctions for contrast, however, cause, because, and effect, therefore, to link ideas. Finally, form complex question structures like embedded questions, can you tell me where the bank is, and tag questions, you're coming with us, aren't you? These skills will improve your communication in both written and spoken English. At the B2 level, you will learn to craft comprehensive narratives for personal information. This means you can share detailed stories about your life, such as, I was born in a small town and moved to the city for university, where I studied engineering and made lifelong friends. You will discuss detailed routines and preferences, including complex schedules. For example, I start my day with a morning jog, then attend meetings and work on projects, and I prefer to unwind in the evening with a good book. Describing objects and places in depth will become second nature. For instance, the museum is a grand building with intricate architecture and vast collections of art and artifacts. You'll also discuss culinary techniques and dietary preferences, like, I enjoy baking pastries and follow a gluten-free diet for health reasons. You will use nuanced emotions and detailed characteristics to express feelings and describe people or things accurately. For example, she felt a mix of excitement and nervousness before the presentation, or the antique table has beautifully carved legs and a polished surface. Giving detailed and nuanced directions will be another skill you'll master, such as to get to the library, walk straight for two blocks, turn left at the fountain, and it will be on your right next to the cafe. Finally, you will handle shopping issues, warranties, and guarantees effectively. For example, I purchased this laptop last month, but it has stopped working. Can I use the warranty to get it repaired or replaced? These vocabulary skills will help you navigate a wide range of everyday situations with confidence and clarity. At the B2 level, you will learn to form advanced relative and participle clauses. For example, the man who lives next door is a doctor, relative clause, and the book, written by an acclaimed author, is a bestseller, participle clause. You will also use the third conditional for hypothetical situations such as, if I had known about the meeting, I would have attended. This structure allows you to talk about unreal past situations and their possible outcomes. Advanced advice structures will be another key area of focus. For instance, you should have taken the earlier train to avoid the traffic, and I would recommend that you review the contract carefully before signing. Making polite and formal requests will be essential using phrases like, could you please send me the report by tomorrow? And would it be possible for you to extend the deadline? Finally, you will learn to narrate using various past tenses and techniques. For example, 
I had been working at the company for five years when I decided to move on, past perfect continuous, and she was walking down the street when she noticed a familiar face, past continuous. These advanced sentence structures will help you communicate more effectively and precisely in both written and spoken English. At the B2 level, you will develop the ability to understand extended speech and lectures on familiar topics and even follow complex lines of argument. This means you can listen to and comprehend detailed explanations or debates on subjects like science, history, or social issues. You will also learn to understand most TV news and current affairs programs. For example, you can watch a news broadcast and grasp the main points, key details, and overall message. Additionally, you will be able to understand the majority of films in standard dialect. This includes following dialogues, plot developments, and character interactions in movies, which will enhance your listening skills and cultural awareness. At the B2 level, you will learn to interact with a degree of fluency and spontaneity that makes regular interaction with native speakers quite possible without strain for either party. This means you can engage in conversations on various topics, share your thoughts, and respond appropriately. You will also be able to produce clear, detailed text on a wide range of subjects. For instance, you might explain your viewpoint on a topical issue, such as climate change or technological advancements, giving reasons and examples to support your opinion. Additionally, you will learn to explain a viewpoint on a topical issue, giving the advantages and disadvantages of various options. For example, on one hand, working from home offers flexibility and comfort. On the other hand, it can lead to isolation and decreased productivity. These speaking skills will enable you to communicate more effectively and confidently in diverse situations, on temporary problems where the writers adopt particular attitudes or viewpoints. This means you can follow complex arguments, identify the writer's stance, and evaluate the evidence presented. You will also develop the ability to understand contemporary literary prose. For example, you can read modern novels and short stories, grasping the themes, character development, and stylistic choices. These reading skills will enable you to engage with a variety of texts, from news articles to literature, enhancing both your language proficiency and critical thinking abilities. At the B2 level, you will learn to write clear, detailed text on a wide range of subjects related to your interests. This includes composing essays, reports, and articles where you can present information, explain ideas, and argue a point of view with supporting details. You will also practice writing an essay or report, passing on information or giving reasons in support of or against a particular point of view. For example, the advantages of renewable energy sources include sustainability and reduced environmental impact, while the disadvantages may involve high initial costs and technological challenges. Additionally, you will learn to write letters that highlight the personal significance of events and experiences. For instance, I am writing to share the wonderful news of my recent promotion. This achievement marks an important milestone in my career and personal growth. These writing skills will help you communicate more effectively in both professional and personal contexts. Thank you for joining us in this comprehensive guide on understanding EFL levels, A1, A2, B1, and B2. We hope you now have a clear understanding of the requirements and skills needed at each level. Mastering these requirements prepares you to effectively communicate at each level, ensuring proficiency in grammar, vocabulary, sentence structures, listening, speaking, reading, and writing skills. As you progress through these levels, remember that consistent practice and application of what you've learned are key to becoming proficient in English. Whether you're just starting at A1 or advancing to B2, each level builds upon the previous one, enhancing your ability to communicate effectively and confidently 
in English. We encourage you to continue your learning journey, seek out opportunities to practice your skills, and engage with native speakers whenever possible. Language learning is a gradual process, and with dedication and persistence, you will achieve your goals. Thank you for watching this video tutorial by Be Smart Education. We hope you found it helpful and informative. Remember, mastering English grammar is a journey, and we're here to support you every step of the way. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more educational videos and tutorials. Click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Join our Facebook page, Be Smart Education, for more resources and community support. Keep practicing and see you in the next video.